Hey guys, thank you so much for watching this video. Please give us a call if you guys are looking to improve your credit score, lower your car payment, buy a car, trade in a car. Uh, if you're looking to purchase your first home, if you're looking to purchase a rental property, we can help you. Give us a call today, 877-205-7771. Talk to you guys soon and thanks again. Hello everyone, this is Calvin Russell, CEO and founder of 850 Club Credit Consultation. Hope everyone's doing well today. Today we're going to talk about the top three banks to help you refinance your car or of course lower your car payment, okay? I did a video very similar to this years back, uh, you know, when it was more so a simplified format, okay? And uh, but now of course banks have changed a few things and now because of interest rates and things of that sort, you most definitely want to make sure you know these top three banks, okay? So let's go. Number one. All right, Capital One Auto Refinance. Yep, uh, of course, Capital One has been a, a, a huge, um, you know, game changer um, in the auto industry alone. What I love about Capital One is that and usually you guys know me, I don't name drop that often, but I mean, you know, I need to do like a video with them or something, I need to hook up with them. So this will probably be that video that we talk about later down the line. We say, oh yeah, remember when he said, you know, he's gonna work with Capital One, so that'd be great. So, but either way, um, the reason why I like their platform is because you know, they start you off, of course, with, you know, um, a credit card, you know, whether you don't have the best credit or you have decent credit, whatever. And then they actually, it's okay. They take your information and then they keep it. And then they also distribute that same information. And then what they do is they see if you qualify later down the line for an auto loan, which they do. That's why I tell people it makes a difference which banks you decide to build a relationship with, okay? For those who have credit, you know, uh, Capital One credit cards, you probably have got some things in the mail simply saying, hey, would you like to get an auto loan or in this case, refinance your car. Now, if you already have an auto loan with Capital One, you won't get that in the mail because most banks won't refinance a loan that you already have with them. Credit unions may do it, but most banks won't do it. Why? So that's how banks make money for the most part. They make money off of interest. So if they have your name, you know, for on a contract for higher interest, it would be stupid to give you another contract with lower interest, right? You got to go work for that somewhere else, get the hard inquiry, learn the interest rates and all the rest of that stuff. But if you don't have your current auto loan with Capital One currently, I strongly recommend you go to the link. I'll put the link down below. And, uh, and that's autorefi.capitalone.com. It was so great about it, it's a soft pull, okay? Make sure you guys keep things G-rated, okay? So either way, <laughs> but either way, it's a soft entry. Won't affect your score in any way, shape, or form. And again, that's why they're number one. The other two banks I'm gonna talk about um, do a phenomenal job. And there's a lot of other banks as well too, but lately what I've been seeing, we look at credit reports every single day. Thanks to you guys, we do about 30, somewhere between 20 and 30 free credit report evaluations a day now. So it's insane. Uh, but I say that to say, I see a lot of trends on who have, you know, um, who has cars refinanced and things of that sort. And you got to understand, there's a window of time. Remember, to refinance your car, you must qualify and your car must qualify, okay? What does that mean? That means normally your score has to be anywhere between 620 or higher, 640 or higher. The higher, the better, okay? The higher, the better. What I love about their soft inquiry process with Capital One um, they don't even, they, they need your social, but they're not going to run it. It's just a verified identity and make sure they got the right car, the right person, so they can give you the right interest rates. And a lot of times, a lot of people don't know that when you put in the numbers for them online, their online system, it's so easy. You put your numbers in and let's say, for example, it says, no, we can't help you at this time when you don't qualify for our refinance program. A lot of times, if you just lower that number that you're putting in, for example, I had a client, she said she put the, she put her payoff in uh, or the, the remaining balance on the car. And um, she says, Calvin, they said, I know that they can't refinance my car. They won't let me move anywhere forward, right? And I said, well, just bring the balance down a little bit. She says, well, why would I do that when that's not what I owe? Well, we can pay the difference off. For example, if you owe $20,000 on your car, but Capital One says, we'll give you, no, we'll refinance $19,000. All you got to do is just pay $1,000 to the bank bring the balance down, and of course, now you're gonna be at you no know, 19,000. Now, there is a daily interest in that. Everyone has a daily interest, unless you're at 0%, right? Which in that case, there would be no need to refinance, really. So, um, but let's be honest. If that's the case, then that means you need to pay them, do it, and then as soon as it updates, as soon as, the, as soon as they deposit that check, you can now do the refinance. Does that make sense? I know it does. So, um, the second thing, your car has to qualify, right? Um, so that means that now certain, most cars like 
past the five, the like five years, I'm probably not going to qualify. Okay, I talked about that in an older video, and of course that still stands today. Most banks are going to be looking for five year old cars or newer. Okay, and then of course the mileage. Well, of course it can't be a 2016 with 115 thousand miles because you want to do so much Uber all the time. That's a whole nother video, right? <laughs> so, but either way, little things like that play a major role. So there's a window of time that you got to catch that window. When your credit is where it needs to be, when your car qualifies, you better go apply for it right now, especially if it's a soft inquiry. And of course, they won't affect your score in any way, shape or form. Now, these next two, unfortunately, just like any other traditional banking, they got to run that credit, right? But there are more and more banks that are starting to do auto loan refinancing. And as I start to find out more about who's doing them and the smartest way to do it. Um, and there's one bank I may talk about on another video uh, because they're phenomenal. But at the same time, I want to make sure that um, they get, you know, that I do my research first before I bring it up to you guys, okay? The number two bank is going to be Wells Fargo. Wells Fargo is actually very low key. Um, they do a lot of uh, auto loan refinances, but what I like is that they take a lot of people from their interest rates, like the double digits, 18%, 14%, 10%, and they got some very good interest rates. Again, you can just go to their site, or you can just Google, you know, Wells Fargo auto loan refinancing. They are very lenient, okay? Because that's the thing. Uh, people don't understand that just because you have, um, they think that just because you have an auto loan with someone that that bank is entitled to give you a lower payment. They don't have to do that. Again, they have your name on a contract. It's up to you to find out who can give you better terms based on where you are right now. Wells Fargo can do that for you. The third bank, okay, actually this probably should have been number two, but mainly because it's not really a bank and that's State Farm. I know, right? So State Farm has an auto loan refinance program. You got to be a 680, but they'll give you 5%. All right. So the greatest thing about State Farm, unlike other banks and stuff like that, you don't have to have an account with them. Okay. So again, this is recent information. You don't have to have an account with them. But again, as your score starts to improve, you'll get a lot of stuff in the mail. And you got a lot of uh, banks that are on the rise right now. Car Finance is one of them. They do a great job at refinancing. Um, open Loan or Open Road Lending, they're doing a great job at you know, on the rise. As you can see, too, if you guys have a Credit Karma account, they're always pushing something, right? That's what keeps Credit Karma free is they got to push you some advertisers. But what's so great about them, though, is that it's giving people an opportunity to see lenders and banks that they never probably knew about you know, on Credit Karma. So I think that's a great way to do it. The problem is, is that with Credit Karma's algorithm, um, these lenders and banks, they, they want a difference. They want a certain score bracket, right? And everyone's fishing in the same pond. I say that to say, you know, you may see that you pre-qualify for something on Credit Karma um, that they're suggesting, but you may not qualify for it because everyone's fishing in that same pond. And, you know, it's just it's just crazy. So but there are a lot of places that do a lot of lending. But again, the top three are going to be Capital One, mainly because of that soft inquiry. I haven't seen anybody do a soft inquiry where there's no obligation to buy, nobody to talk to. You put it online. Either you qualify or you don't. You can move the numbers around. It's really simple, really simple. OK. And uh, of course, you got Wells Fargo. And then, of course, you're going to have. Uh, State Farm with their 5%, uh, you know, refinance. And again, you got your local banks. Um, you know, I'm not knocking your local banks. Since I'm not near your local bank, I won't know what the rates are. So I'm talking about more so on a national level where everybody is watching to say, well, hey, I live in Florida or hey, I live in Georgia or hey, I live in Nevada. And you know what? You know, what banks, what national banks do you recommend? And those will be the banks to lower your car payment immediately. And if your score is not where it needs to be to do it, we can help you, okay? If, in, if you just want us to see if you're on the right track, we don't charge you, to, you know, to do something like that, okay? That's our free credit report evaluation. We try to do them on Fridays because it's always a busy day. Uh, but at the same time, you guys can hit us up anytime you want to. Uh, of course, you guys see the number that cross, go all across the street all the time. We're here to help you. We want to help you. And we're expanding the team as well, too. You're going to see the office change a little bit around here. I'm at home now. This is the basement. But uh, you guys are going to see some big changes coming. Uh, we're partnering with a lot of different banks and uh, credit unions and real estate ventures and things of that sort because we want to make sure that everybody, no, where, no matter where you are, because see, everyone that's in Illinois, they're so spoiled, okay? But either way, I just want to give you guys a heads up. We got a lot more great things happening. No matter where you guys live, just stay tuned. Thank you guys so much. Have a great day.